you strong. Hey guys, me Elysian back here for another video and today I'm going to be opening up another box of Eternity Code. Now, I was actually lucky because they got this uh, set back in stock and I, when I saw that I bought another one because this seems to be in higher demand. As I said, I've got plans, I said in the last video, I've got plans for more UGLA videos like in the see I've opened up a four special editions of the Ig uh, Ignis Assault and then I opened up a set of Eternity Code and we opened up pretty good we got the got the Ghost Girl and the new Talker so I'm hoping we can pull maybe another Ghost Girl if I can get this open Let's start. So, I've also got plans for a special Pokemon video, so stay tuned for that. And for our first foil, it's uh, the Wind, wind Witch, uh, the Witch Crafter. I keep wanting to say Wind Witch, but Witch Crafter, quick play spell. And then we have Beast King. Like I'm surprised that we got more beasts like Beast King Bob Ross got another like print. Even using a Beast Warrior deck, I've never actually used the card itself. So Okay. Okay, we now have the, our first secret rare, which is the Deep Sea Spell, which Banishes one mortal monster from your graveyard to add one at level four lower sea serpent monster from your deck to your hand. Like again, it's a it's a it's a rotor for war monsters. So that's actually pretty decent as our first like secret. Pretty sure for that card it's gonna be mostly used in like Mermel and um what are they called? Marincess. So but knowing Gimme he'll try to put it into his uh like most likely his Atlantean Mermel. So But I've i I've got actually a couple cards to give to a lot of people after this lockdown is done. So, up by pulling a different secret seems pretty good. But I'm hoping for another ghost girl, honestly. Okay, we got our first ultra, which is the um, patrol. I actually don't know what this one is. Hang on. Uh, oh, it's the equip card. Okay. Uh, it's in the equip card of the Grave of Special One Patrol. So that seems pretty cool. Since I've already like opened up a set, we can just kind of go straight for the um hollows. Oh, another another rose girl. Nice. Okay, we got our second secret rare. Okay, so we got the Gizmek Uka, the festive fox. Uh, each time your opponent normal summons or special summons a monster, flick three hundred damage to, to them. You can use this effect. You can use the following effect. Once per turn, if a monster is special summoned from the extra deck. Doing the damage step, 
can special summon this card from your hand. If this card is normal special summoned, you can target one phase of monster you put control. Special summon one monster from your deck, those attack is equal to its defense. And same attribute as that monster. So, okay, like, it's cool. We got two different secret rares. So I guess, like, that's quite quick. You don't normally get secret rares that quick. What's the chance that I've got, like, three? <laughs> It's happened before, actually, there's been a case where, um, where there was a set that had no secrets in. I don't know what box that was, I think maybe on the channel. Okay, we got our second Ultra Air, which is the, um, uh, uh, which is, uh, Shadow of the Generator Bosses. I almost missed that. So... Um, I'll probably upload this video most probably, probably Friday, and then hopefully the, um, my, uh, Pokemon live video will hopefully be uploaded on Sunday, or whenever I've got free time at the moment. Which I probably is. Oh, another one of the uh, invoked. Nice. Okay. Like, is the is the um if you warrior link master secret or also? I can never remember. Probably look it up after this video. Okay, we got Marine says Great Bubble Reef, which is their newest like monster. Don't think I got that in my um in my last box. So it's nice when I'm seeing like cars I haven't seen in a last box, which I think is each one of these super uh ultra so far and Secrets. It just means that I kind of look like a monarch. I guess going against monarchs, if anything's big and br big and dark, it looks like Caius. Like it's, I'm still not used to not seeing like any rares because I opened up the special editions of. Ignis Assault. I and Sword that. And then opening this set, Eternity Code, for the first time, not seeing any rares, kind of. It's odd, honestly. It's quite different. Okay, we got our Union Driver as our third Ultra Rare. Are you the one that gets used in ABC? I'm pretty sure there's a, a newer Union Master that's getting used in ABC at the moment. I think this will probably be the last, um, oh, nice lady of, you're the, uh, newest, yeah, you are, you're the newest lair card, forgot they got some new ones, honestly. So. We got. I almost thought it was a, um, oh, what are they called? I've completely forgot what they're called. Savage used to play them. Um, Alter Geist, that's it. I thought it was an Alter Geist for a second, just how it looked. Okay, we 
we've got three packs left. And I'm pretty sure I didn't misplace an ultra. Let me just double check. Nope, we're still missing one ultra. Now we're invoked. Is it going to be like in this pack, like our last, um, like this card was? It was in our second to last pack. Yep, second to last pack, and it is the newest Dragon Maid Fusion Master. So let's give this a shot. So one Dragon Maid Master plus one level 5 or higher Dragon Master. During the standby phase, you can special one level 9 or lower Dragon Maid Master from your hand or graveyard. That effect seems really good. Um, if it was any other dragon, then it would be better. Uh, when your opponent activates a spell, uh, activates a card or effect, quick effect, to get the activation, you do destroy that card. Also, return that monster from, hang on, uh, one moment. Oh, I was being called away, so where was I? Um, you do destroy that card. Also, after that, return this card from your... From, oh, return this card to the extra deck. So it kind of has a neo spacing, like the fusions effects, I guess. And if you do special summon one house dragon maid from your extra deck. Okay, so it swaps it out for another dragon maid. Joe that seems pretty cool. Pretty sure, sad, I'm pretty sure, not savage, that um, Brick's already bought all of his. I think he bought them um, just after the lockdown gone into mentioned so let's see what our last super is. Oh, it's the um it's the water charmer. Good. I'm happy to leave it off with that. I'm actually really happy. Like So to tell off we got I think to, to get no duplicates ultras nor duplicate secrets it's actually pretty cool obviously i would have liked like another ghost girl but no i've got i've got some pretty cool cards right here like i'm i'm a big fan of like ferrets and foxes so i really actually like this card and gimme is gonna really need i've never uh, another two copies of this card because it, it's a rotor for war monsters so so rotor for sea serpents, level four low sea serpents, but yeah. And also you can only use one of them once per turn, but still. So nice. And for the supers, I'm actually happy about it's probably of the water charmer because I didn't pull one from the last set and I think it's really cool to bring out all the old charmers in link form. So this one. Uh, it's all one more monster in your project graveyard. That's the basic way of this card's link summoned. If this links to a card, it's talked about no, one more monster from your list. So, yeah, it's the same effects. Same effects, but obviously, I think we've almost got all of them. I think we may be above halfway now. So, yeah, that's been my. Uh, entity code, probably the last entity code set I'm going to open for now. But stay tuned for new videos. I've got to try and do a good ratio between Yu Gi Oh and Pokemon, and I am trying to get some magic done as quickly as I can. So, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.